वेलकम टू द चैनल नॉलेज स्टार कॉन्टिन्यूस नॉलेज एक्सेलेंस माई नेम इज निशा मसूर इन दिस वीडियो वी विल गेट टू नो अबाउट हाउ डू एंटी माइक्रोबियल पेप्टाइड एक्ट नाउ आई एक्सपर्ट डॉक्टर नीलू नवानी प्रोफेसर एंड इन चार्ज ऑफ माइक्रोबियल डायवर्सिटी रिसर्च सेंटर पी एच डी कोर्डिनेटर विल एक्सप्लेन यू इन डिटेल अबाउट दिस टॉपिक सो टू गेट कम्प्लीट इन्फॉर्मेशन वॉच फुल वीडियो विदाउट स्किल Now, how do these antimicrobial peptides act? So, there are three proposed models of their action. They mainly target the cell membrane, and uh, cell membrane when they target, they would either kill by carpet model or by barrel model or by toroidal pore model. So, you can see here, this is the toroidal pore model. That's the wormhole model, and here the AMPs would penetrate in the cell, and they form a ring kind of a structure, and the cationic peptides which are there they weaken the membrane wall and therefore they will create a pore over here and once such pores are created in the uh, cell membrane the contents of the cytoplasm would leak out uh, according to the barrel stay model the amps would dig through the membrane and therefore call uh, cause leakage they can also trigger apoptosis and in the carpet like model it is proposed that the amps cover the whole membrane like a carpet wait 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 are you worry about your project training dissertation internship don't think too much because nano science and technology consortium in short nstc is giving you a golden opportunity to do the same tasks nstc also conducts workshop on amazing topics so if you want to register in the workshop The registration link is given in the description box below, or you may go to the website www.nanoschool.in, where you can easily enroll in the workshops. So just check it out right now. And particularly with their hydrophobic ends towards their, uh, towards the phospholipid bilayer, and the hydrophilic ends towards the solvent, and therefore they uh, mimic the detergent action in this case. So any of the mechanisms they can use to. Uh, kill now how do you extract the amps so extraction of the amps is by the conventional approach you collect the source material from uh, which the amp will be produced you homogenize or lyse it and you extract with a solvent you can also uh, use chromatography for purification and concentration so this is a regular flow path which we follow for any compound you can also uh, uh, look for approaches which are molecular approaches like you can have the source you homogenize and lyse it and then you isolate the rna prepare the cdna and transform the genes which are uh, expressing these amps and uh, in the host cells and it becomes easy to purify the amps then hope you like the video here i would like to give you an important information that nano science and technology consortium or nstc organized the nano technology workshops on very interesting topics also i would like to tell you about the initiatives of nstc in which you can also be a part of like mentorship patent commercialization joint product development research projects consultancy services nano materials for your research projects training programs or customized training programs workshops or customized workshops So that's all. If you want to see these type of videos then please do comment. We will definitely reach out to you. Subscribe to the channel Knowledge Star and hit the bell icon to never miss an update. Thank you. For more updates subscribe to our channel. Click the links shown on the screen to stay connected.